Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Q&A. Make sure to press every single button you can so everyone can get to class on time and hear the answer to Kay's question. What if a human and a mermaid did reproduce? And the answer is simple. We can't. Other than them being unable to consent to humans, we have a lot of very big differences. Our digestive, cardio, and muscular systems are entirely different. And of course, the skeletal system as well. Our hip bones are very much different. What our femur is, is their pectoral fin. And the bone composition themselves are entirely different, with merfolk having somewhat more flexible bones to deal with water pressure. Merfolk are also massive in comparison to us. While humans are about five and a half feet tall on average, merfolk range from eight to 10 feet long. And though our bits may fit together, neither one is equipped to carry the fetus of another species. For example, amniotic eggs need a consistent water pressure so they don't collapse, and by default develop in groups of two to six within the womb. Additionally, merfolk are sentient but not sapient. A mer may become attracted to a human, but a human has no consistent way of caring for pups, and we do not share the same understanding of the world with mers. I'd compare it to an ostrich being attracted to a human, or trying to crossbreed a hippo and an elephant. It just doesn't make sense. That's all for today. Check the FAQ before asking questions, and please support my coffee.